it's Coach Teef with a not very normal uh, running video for everyone who ever watched videos on this channel. I'm going to answer questions about myself. This wasn't my idea. I got tagged. I'm playing runner's tag where uh, different running vloggers on YouTube are tagging each other and then we answer questions about ourselves. So if you don't want to know anything about me, skip this. If you do want to hear my answers, go ahead and watch. I'm just going to talk about myself. It's not my idea. Blame CC Runner and uh, check out his videos on YouTube. He's, he's the one that tagged me. But he has some really good videos. Um, you should check him out, by the way. The link's down below. How long have you been running? I've been running since I was a freshman in high school, which was a long, long time ago. Over 20 years now. Why did you start running? My brother was in cross country and he was successful his freshman year. So when he was a sophomore, I came out. And I was pretty good at it, too. What's the furthest distance you've ever ran? A half marathon. That's far enough. I don't know if I'm going to ever go after the marathon or not. Maybe, but not for a while, because it takes some serious training. And I don't like running really, really long. <laughs> What's your best running memory? I, I live near a, a city, so there's a lot of good runners. So I never won my first varsity race until I was a senior in high school when I won the 800 at a Brookfield, I think it was Brookfield Central Invitational. But I came off the last curve and I just blew everybody away. And it was awesome. It felt really good to win. So that's my favorite running memory back a long, long time ago. What shoes do you run in? I wear Kinvara's Saucony. They're like minimalist running shoes. I've changed my stride, and you should too. Run so you don't all heel strike. You should run in some more minimalist shoes. I don't run barefoot though. That's, that's too far, too extreme for me. Favorite and least favorite distances to run? Well, when I was in high school, I was kind of fast, so the shorter stuff, anything from the 400 to the mile was good. Now, now, I kind of like the 5K. It's still kind of short. I am going to try to run a half marathon again, though. So, I don't know. That was all right when I did it. Do you have a running partner? I run with my wife when I can, but I have three children, so that's really rare. But my wife's my running partner. She's the best. What's your favorite place to run? The trails in Wisconsin. When there isn't, when there isn't snow on them, the trails in Wisconsin are awesome. I run at this place called Pike Lake State Park uh, in uh, southeastern Wisconsin, and it's beautiful, uh, especially in the fall. What's your favorite running accessory? Right here, baby. This is my favorite running accessory, my Tips for Running t-shirt. Actually, I got something new for my wife, <coughs> and I got to test this out. I got a uh, GoPro. See this? GoPro 3. I'm going to try and incorporate this into running. If you have any ideas, Give me suggestions as to what to do with this and running. I think I'll run with this in a tough mutter because that looks cool. Outdoor, indoor running? The outdoors! I don't even like making videos indoors, so always the outdoors. What's your favorite time of the day to run? At dusk. Just when it's starting to get dark and there's no wind and it's a little cooler. It's so beautiful. What races have you run? Okay, let me start. I've run the 400, the 800, the 1,000 meter dash, which is an indoor track event, the 1500, the 1600, the mile. Believe it or not, those are all three different distances. The 3200 in high school, the 3000 steeplechase, the 5K, an 8K cross country race, a 10K, and the half marathon. Those are all of them I run. I've raced all of those. The music that I listen to when I run, um, Anything except country. Not a big country fan. Everything else, thumbs up. Sorry, country fans. Hottest or coldest weather you've ever run in? Hottest, probably a hundred. The coldest, I remember this day distinctly. It was negative 10 Fahrenheit. It was super cold for like two weeks when I used to run in college at um, Oshkosh, Wisconsin. And we went outside running about five miles and I had a face thing. And I ran with the wind, I took the face thing down and it froze to my neck. When I get back from the run, I had icicles on my eyebrows and my eyelashes. That was ridiculous. I don't recommend it. Don't run unless it's at least above zero Fahrenheit. Other exercises I love, well, I like obstacle races and I like to lift weights. I'm, uh, I guess I'm a little bit bigger of a guy for a runner because 
After I was done with college, I started lifting weights some um, because I wanted to be fit top to bottom, not just aerobically fit. Are you currently training for something? Not exactly right now. In March, I'm going to start gearing up because I'm going to run a half marathon in the summer and I'm going to do two Tough Mudders and I want to be in the top 5% in the Tough Mudder and I want to be under 130 in the half marathon. And that's what my goals are, I guess, to get under 130 in the half marathon. Advice for new runners, set some goals. That's what keeps me going. Set goals and run consistently. Join a team. Join a running club. Set some goals. Race. That's my tips for you future runners. And finally, why did I start making running videos? Because I have a running website, tipsforrunning.com. And I thought it was kind of boring, just written articles, so I added videos. Plus, I went to school for it. At Oshkosh, I went to school and I studied video production stuff. These aren't exactly professional videos, but I think they're a little bit uh, smoother than some of the stuff out there. So, I, I like making the videos. I've been pretty much educational, but maybe with this GoPro, I might, I might try and be more entertaining I guess I'm not that boring am I <laughs> all right the last thing uh, who am I gonna tag I'm gonna tag two people I don't know where they're gonna go with this I'm gonna tag Amanda Russell um, she used to be a runner but she had some bad accident broke her leg or something like that but she does a bunch of videos on YouTube and she was a collegiate runner I'm also gonna tag this runner named skinny runner who's a hilarious blogger I don't know if she should she will make a video but she should skinny runner because she's funny all right that's it happy trails from coach teeth i hope you enjoyed learning about me bye